Hey everyone, Sol here, and welcome to my draws for the very surprising uh, VVLD. This is a global first weapon that JP has not had access to yet at this point. And it's pretty exciting. Uh, they showed this thing off, and it completely caught everyone off by, by surprise. And it looks amazing. So, I kind of have VV built weapon-wise. Um, but we are going to be chasing both EX and LD on this weapon. Everything else on this banner, I pretty much already have. I already have Kefka's Burst, Zidane's fully built. I'm not really interested in Steiner. And Aiko is built as well. So, I'm legit just chasing VV weapons. Hopefully, I have some good luck. Good luck to everyone that is drawing in this banner. I know a lot of people are very, very excited. That's a bad start. It's a bad start when the freebie gives you <laughs> a 1 out of 11, 15. But okay, yeah, let's get to chasing. <clears throat> I have no idea how many tickets I'm going to be spending. So we're just going to just have to just play this thing by ear and see how things go. Hopefully this weapon... Now, if I do get VB's LD early... Um, I because there's there's so many weapons on this banner. I mean, we have Zidane, Steiner, and uh, Aiko with their EXs and assumably weapons, and then we have Vivi's LD and his EX plus Kefka's burst. Uh, I might just just token the EX, but again, that has to, we have to get that LD first, and oh man, that is, that is one spicy LD, I already have some team comps in mind, that I'm going to be running with it, because it does have, if you're not aware, it does have a 30, I think it's, the, it drains the party's HP by 30% uh, when the LD is used, after the LD is used, it gives you five stacks called Memories of the Soul, and every single time VV acts, after he acts, there's a follow-up attack, and the follow-up attack drains one stack of that Memories of the Soul. And so, um, and then every time that follow-up activates, I think it's another 15% of the party's HP is subtracted. So if you're running Vivi uh, with his LD, you definitely need to run him uh, with some healers or tank, you know, to get the attention off him so he can do his thing. He's, he's very, very, very strong. His LD is extraordinarily strong for right now. Uh, and where Global's at, just on the eve of Lufenia, it really feels like the devs are trying to give players, um, you know, a, a nice foot up uh, on Lufenia because we are we are right there, uh, and doing 100% splash uh, to all enemies uh, with the follow up and on the LD use itself is a damn good way to do it. Vivi always had massive attack potencies and a massive max brave pool. I mean, that's he's never been at want for that. <clears throat> but um, the, the problem was that he didn't give himself Fire Enchant aside from his C65, so his EX was non-elemental for some reason, I, I don't know why, uh, but his LD gives him Fire Enchant, he now has that as long with his Fire and Peril, which he's had for a long time. So, and also his LD also deals Dark Damage, it's a Fire Dark, but it only imperils Fire. So basically, you're just going to be just dealing fire damage <laughs> uh, pretty much non-stop. But yeah, he's, he's looks, he looks very fun, very, very strong. And uh, I did not have Vivi built before this. I'll be, I'll be the first to admit that uh, because he was a cursed character and I just, I just didn't want to touch it. But after seeing that LD, that was like a siren's call right there. I saw that LD and I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, let's, uh, let's let's do some chasing. So, yeah, that's that's how I wound up here. And boy, the tickets have been uh, have not been kind thus far. <clears throat> so hopefully things change here sooner rather than later, and hopefully things change before the connecting issues start uh, getting very 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 frequent because more and more players are logging on realizing that this weapon's out a lot a lot of hype around this weapon not only because it was a global first but also because just how crazy strong it looks so oh no we're doing so good come on game we're doing so good maybe that's a long connecting because it's a good weapon maybe not maybe it's just it's just the coat 
Damn. Well, okay, so not only am I dealing with connection issues, I'm also dealing with the fact that golds are uh, avoiding me pretty hard right now. What, one gold on tickets and, and 40? And the uh, multi was a 1 of 11, 15 CP. Yeah, it's ugh, tough sledding. Oh my god, and the uh, connection issues are in full swing. Here we go. Don't just stare at connecting screens while nothing's happening. Okay, Steiner 15, that's a gold, so that's a step in the right direction. Another 8 gold 35, back to back golds. Yikes. Okay. Okay. Let's get back to drawing. <clears throat> oh. I took a break. I, I, <laughs> I took a break hoping that the, uh, the connection issue would be fixed. Or at least a little bit better. It looks like they're, they're, it, it's going in between. In between fast and lagging like a mofo. Oh, and good luck. I don't know if I've said this yet in the video, but uh, good luck to everyone that's drawing on this banner. A lot of people are hyped about this one. I just hope that uh, in like a month or two, we don't see ever the Phoenix stage have a uh, fire absorb. <laughs> Which uh, the devs seemingly like to do with every single elemental character that's. Uh, that gets released, they have their two week of synergy or whatever, or one week, and then uh, everything starts becoming element absorb of their element. So hopefully, if Vivi doesn't fall into the same fate, but uh, we'll see. Oh my god! I'm gonna be here all night. Shake off this, this bronze slow connecting juju. <clears throat> nah, it didn't work. How's your guys' night going? Or day? Whenever you're watching this. Hope your day or night is going well. My day today was spent uh, doing some things around the house. Had the day off. And uh, I'm looking forward to this banner in the Abyss. The Abyss is always fun to stream. Talking with people in chat. <clears throat> Having a good time. Distracting myself from the horrors of the monotony. I have not touched the new Abyss yet, although because it looks like it was based on the Mist Continent from Final Fantasy IX, I'm thinking that it's going to be like the Beta Abyss we got where uh, the Final Fantasy VII characters were synergy, and then there were even requirements where you had to use uh, all Final Fantasy VII, so 
I'm hoping, for player's sake, that that's not the case where it's all FF9. I mean, if it is, I'll be okay, because I'll have... I already have Zidane, Garnett, uh, and Beatrix built. And then assuming that VV doesn't continue to uh, hold me in a headlock here, I'll have VV as well. So that'll be four characters, that'll be more than enough, I'd say. Hopefully some people get Zidane on this banner, <clears throat> and they build him up, because man, he is fun. He holds up in the Phoenix too, pretty darn well. At least early on. Okay, here we go. Hit me with that LD. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, close. That's the EX. I did not have the EX. So, I will take that for sure. It's the one EX on this banner that I actually needed and wanted. <clears throat> Alright, come on. Uh, now, we got the EX. We're feeling good. Let's keep the momentum going. Let's bring home the LD. <clears throat> Walk away happy. Okay, another another gold. I'll take that. Come on, game, you're doing so good. You're being so fast. So I guess it saves me some uh, power stones. Starting to roll in now. To the connecting hit again. Man, drawing on uh, debut of a anticipated character. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough sledding. So, so slow. Oh, what, is, what did you guys think about Phoebe's costume that they uh, released with his uh, LD? I, I pre, pre personally, I love that costume. He goes from being like this cute, timid looking character to he looks he looks like a black waltz kind of character and I, I definitely think that was the original intent where he's supposed to look a lot more intimidating and scary. I really like the design. It gives me uh gives me heavy set survives, like the color of it. Um, you know, how the outfit itself actually looks. I really, really, really like it. I think Devs did a great job you know, bringing that into the game, making it look nice. It's tempting. It's really tempting to buy, but I don't. So unfortunately, I don't like Vivi enough to buy it for him. But uh, yeah, any, anyone that invests in that costume, in my opinion, is making 
a hell of a choice. As a, as a gorgeous costume. that LD. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Oh, ho, ho, ho. let's go. Okay. We are out of this banner. I spent what? 125 tickets. I'll take that. I'll take that all damn day. I got the EX I needed. Two of them, in fact. And then the LD. I avoided all the other EXs on this banner. Oh, I'm so, I'm so happy with this. Okay, yeah, so that's gonna be it for me, guys. Thank you all for watching. I uh, hope you guys have just as good of luck as I did, if not better. And I will have some VB Showcase vids up here a bit. So, yeah, thank you guys again for watching, and take care of yourselves. See you again soon.